Hello, beloved, and welcome to your reading. We're going to be seeing the messages that the Divine wants you to receive in this timeless reading. As usual, I always remind you that these readings are generalized and to take what is resonating with you, leaving behind anything that is not for you. We are going to be working with our tarot cards and also our oracle cards to deliver the messages that are here. So as I'm getting your cards for you, I want to remind you that personal readings are currently available on my website, which is linked in the description box below. When you get to my website, you'll be able to see all the different offerings that are there. I want to also tell you that the tarot course, all the information that you need is also on my website for those of you who were asking for the tarot course. And the candle ceremonies, they're going to be starting very soon. Again, everything that you need to know is in the description box below. There's a lot that is going on, on my website. So if you want to see all the other things that I do, my website is where it's at. Okay, so we have quite a few cards on the table. So we're going to jump right into the meat of this reading because there is a lot that is currently going on here. So you've received two major arcana card of the full card and also the chariot card. I like how these two cards are interacting with each other because there's a feeling that is here where the divine is asking you to start taking a leap of faith. Okay, because you've been sitting here arming and arming for quite some time about some movements, some changes, things that you need to get on doing. There's a sense of procrastination that is here. And the divine is saying to you that unless you go and take action, nothing is going to change. So the divine is saying that as you are here at the edge of making that leap of faith, understand that having the energies of the chariot, this is bringing that energy of victory. The chariot card is fast, swift, and victorious. But the divine is saying that the victory that is here it is going to be that sense of like having an up and down type of energy that is there. Why? Because you're receiving the energies of the seven of wands. The seven of wands is indicating that you are going to have to put up a good fight around things that you love, things that you care about. The wands are all about that fire, that drive, that passion. And the seven of um, the number seven of the chariot card being that it is a lucky number seven. The divine is saying that your luck is directly connected to the action that you're going to be taking. Once you've taken that action, having the energies of the seven of wands, it is indicating that you are going to have to stand your ground because there are going to be some challenges that are here. Perhaps these challenges are coming from other people. Whichever way this challenge is coming in, the divine is saying that you are going to be walking with lady luck on this journey that is here. The victory that you need is here. So you must stand your ground, stand your ground and fight for what you believe in because you have an energy that is victorious. Fast victory is here for you. Okay. So the divine is saying that right now there's a sense of you really sitting down as the page of cups, the page of cups. You're here at the beginning of something. Okay. But before you get started, the divine is saying that it is important to get that energy of clarity around your feelings, okay? Because your heart center, the things that you love, that feeling of visualizing is going to be very, very important for you. So having the energies of the page of cups, it is all about you stepping into your daydream, really feeling and thinking what it is that you want. If pigs could fly, what is possible and the divine is saying that right now anything is possible for you because you've received that major arcana card that is indicating that there is a new beginning the pages are at the beginning of something the energies that the page is bringing is that energy of excitement is that energy that youthful type of energy so the divine is saying that have that excitement that passion have that energy of fire, of drive, but also emotionally knowing where you are going because this is going to be important. So all your senses are working well together because the divine is saying that before you step into the energy of the major arcana card of the chariot, before you go and take the action that you need to take, it is important for you to be very cautious 
and this is why the page of cups is here because we're seeing you here sitting weighing things out being very cautious about the action that you're going to be taking because the divine is saying that caution is going to be very very important and the divine is going to elaborate this message that is here because you've received the energies of the four of pentacles okay so the divine is saying that you're going to be taking some action before you take that action make sure that you are taking care of your health you are taking care of your money having the energies of the four of pentacles it is you taking action to make sure that you're creating stability around your money you're creating stability around the things that you love your health and your possessions so this is why the divine is saying that at this moment in time for some of you you just feel like stepping in the energy of the full card the major arcana card is scary because you can't afford to make any mistakes okay you've made mistakes in the past these mistakes have costed you quite a lot and then going forward there is just that energy where you could just be feeling fearful of taking that leap of faith fearful of the beginning that you need to take because I told you victory is yours but the victory that is here is connected to you taking action so the divine is saying that it is very good to be cautious but at the same time don't be so cautious that you make yourself afraid you talk yourself out of taking the action that you need to take so the divine is saying that it is important for you to understand that you have beautiful energies that are here once you've taken the action once you've taken that leap of faith we're seeing you here climbing the ladder because the three of wands is all about going places so you certainly are going places there's expansion there is growth that is here growth and expansion connected to you taking action okay so at some point you're going to jump off this cliff this edge that you're standing at and you're going to be seeing that before you know it you are going to be soaring you're going to be flying things are going to be changing for you the three of wands is really really about the passion the fire the drive you are really excited about climbing this ladder about bringing an important change that is going to make you feel really really good so the divine is saying that remember we told you to be cautious and it is good that you are being cautious as the fool but at the same time okay the divine is saying that for some of you there's almost like a fear you're being too over cautious because you are wanting to see the whole picture you're wanting to have like confirmation before you take that leap of faith you are really wanting to make sure that you don't fail but the divine is saying that life doesn't work like that okay so right now yes you are not seeing the whole picture but at the same time don't let yourself not take action don't cheat yourself don't talk yourself out of taking the action that you need to take because you can't see the whole picture at the moment so like i said for some of you you want a guarantee that you are going to be victorious you are going to be successful and because you want a guarantee you are not taking the action that you need to take and because of that you are missing your blessings lady luck is not going to hang around waiting for you forever so this is why the divine is saying that it is now or never take that leap of faith and start walking towards this swift victory that is being brought about by the energy of the chariot card so whatever it is that you're afraid of right now it is good to be cautious but you must stay balanced because you can be too cautious and then you don't take action but at the same time you might just like just go and take that leap of faith without any planning and then this when this is when things are going to fail so the divine is saying that it is good to weigh things out to think about the future to visualize to make sure you've got the money to make sure you've got you know your health to make sure that you can really go on this journey and be victorious but at the same time you cannot see the whole picture because life is always you know going up and down there's always something that you cannot completely calculate so the divine is saying that take that leap of faith after you've done all the thinking after you've done all the calculating that you need to do because once you do that the victory the success is going to be really really quickly because you have the energies of the three of wands where you're seeing you here being victorious climbing the ladder going places and it is really really good but the divine is saying that as you are on this journey like we already told you there is that energy of victory that is here once you have 
the bag. As you're seeing with the Four of Pentacles, once you have that money, once you're in a good place, it is important to protect your valuables. It is important to protect your money. As you're observing our card, you can see that you're really in that energy of really protecting what is rightly yours. So the divine is saying that going forward, protecting your money, your resources is going to be very, very important. So do everything that is in your power to bring that stability and protection around your money. Okay, around the things that you're doing online, making sure that you are very, very secure online and no one is trying to scam you and take your money away from you. Okay, so these are the energies that you're currently working with. Don't be too cautious. Okay, that you don't take that leap of faith and then you miss out on lady luck. But at the same time, don't be a fool that you just take a leap of faith without calculating anything. The divine is saying that this reading is all about being balanced and being wise. So these are the energies that you're currently working with. Again, if you need your own personal reading, everything you need to know is in the description box below. And if you need to start learning tarot, okay, the course that I've created is very in-depth, but at the same time, it is fun, it is intuitive. I'll get you learning and understanding the cards quickly, and you're never going to need to rely on memorizing the cards. It is a powerful course indeed. So again, everything that you need to know about all the different services that I offer, cord cutting ceremonies, new moon, full moon ceremonies, all the different offerings, they are on my website, which is linked in the description box below. So this is me saying goodbye.